Hey guys, so I purchased this Star Wars Blu-ray box set coming with uh, nine discs. So I've I've got this from Amazon.com. I ordered this on 15th at 5 p.m. Japan's time, and today 18th it arrived at about 1 p.m. So and I chose the fastest shipment method which took like $13 extra $30 so this itself was $79.99 so at last Star Wars in Blu-ray so this is it so I'm kind of doing a review quick review I'm not watching this movie yet but I'm just showing you how this looks this is inside pretty nice touch this paper made and this thing and each page has blu-ray disc with movies themselves and three bonus discs and these pictures are not photograph is a painting as you can see I think whatever maybe and these are bonus discs yes this is it and in the last page it has booklet Guide to the Galaxy so when you finish reading this booklet whatever you know how to go to Galaxy I think step one blah 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 not really episode one episode two I think this is a guide of uh, contents of the discs yeah. So this is the item itself. Besides that, I have something to mention. So I've I've bought several DVDs, Blu-rays from Amazon US and here's my claim. So here's some damage. This is the only damage I can find. So, yeah, and other than that, uh, only one. If you call, if you think this is a damage, this is another damage. So two damage, and uh, this came in this box. Cheap, cheapish, usual box. So this is my claim. I don't know. I live in Japan, and uh, when I ordered. Canon ink, like uh, this Canon ink from Amazon Japan, this small package. It, this was sent in like this rush. You can't see out of it's out of frame, but this came in this ridiculously huge box, which I really thought that it was a uh, anti echo, but yeah, that was good. That was good. This wasn't hurt, even though I wouldn't care. But definitely, I paid. I paid some bucks of money. So, yeah, of course, discs were not hurt. Not hurt, but yeah, still, this is collectible case. Pretty nice case. So, and I'm not gonna get another package. So, yeah, this thing. And, and it, especially when I paid extra 13 bucks of money and they sent this in this cheap box. Anyway, that's it. Maybe American people think differently, but yeah. That's not cool. So maybe if you want if you want this thing nicely, maybe you should go to some store and get it. Not buy Amazon from Amazon, I don't know. 
But if you're if you're a person like me who cares about these little things, you know, I know. But still, it's some someone might someone would care about those things. So just just that's just it. This was cheap for me, cheaper actually. This was seventy nine point nine nine dollars. The DVD, uh, the item itself, but in Japan on Amazon Japan, this was uh, twelve thousand yen, which is like one hundred twenty hundred. So still, it's not as it's not half, but it's almost it's almost half, and it's really for me cheaper. This version, of course, this doesn't have Japanese side subtitle and audio, but still, I can manage to uh, understand I will try to understand yeah that's it so thanks for watching I hope this video was helpful and ah here's another thing so I've read quite a lot of reviews on Amazon users review that they don't like uh, the new uh, adjustment of like uh, characters, characters appearance or another line like uh, episode 6 the Darth Vader says no at, in the end and I've read many 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 comments that they don't they hate it but I don't really care the one reason I got this blu-ray I wanted to see Star Wars in the best quality you know, Blu-ray now it's best quality for commercial use. So, and I'm not such a big Star Wars fan, but I am still a Star Wars fan. So, yeah, high definition in Blu-ray at last. So I'm happy about it. So I will watch them later. So bye bye. Thanks for watching.